to Ondo State, where children rescued from a church by the Nigeria police in Ondo State have refused to return to their families. Some parents accused the pastor of the church of hypnotizing their wards. The state's Ministry of Women Affairs has now disclosed that it will make moves to rehabilitate some of the teenagers who were rescued from illegal detention at the Whole Bible Believers Church in Ondo State. TVC News, Ayo Deji Muradio has more. The doors raised by the rescue of more than 77 members from the Old Bible Believers Church in Ondo City has refused to settle. Even after the release of the church members and children by the police, some of them have refused to go home with their parents. Some of the parents who spoke with journalists at the police headquarters accused the assistant pastor of hypnotizing their words. They described his action as uncondly and want government to bring him to justice. They said they want to release you. Let's go home. He said he cannot follow me. He said anywhere pastor is going, we follow pastor. Even though he's said fire, we follow him. This is what I'm planning. Even police, I'm just begging the police officer. Maybe they can bring it out for me somewhere so that we tight it. We use rope to tight him so that we put him in the motor, we carry him home. You are, we bore you in a New Testament Christian mission. Then we are attending the part life. How can you die, they, they, they go to another church that you will leave? Uh, he said we don't have the same pay together. Spokesperson of the State Police Command, Fumilayo Otolami, confirmed that the children said they would not leave the command until their pastors are released. She added that the situation propelled the State Minister of Women Affairs and other relevant agencies to intervene. We realize that despite all our talks on Saturday, there are still some people who refuse to leave, saying they want to follow the Lord and that they were comfortable staying within the police premises, that they were not going to go home, they were not going to follow their parents back home. The State Commissioner for Women and Fear said the government is willing to rehabilitate the children who have refused to go home with their parents. We must get some background information how these children became so hypnotized, so indoctrinated, and what is the way forward. Do they need rehabilitation? So if we needed to do that, then we will have to work legally to take custody of those ones. Then some of these children are already released to the parents to go. So what we intend doing is that let us have our information first. Let me report back to the government. Then we have orphanages and we have children home. And we have rehabilitation because the way these children are talking, we think some of them should even be taken to the rehabilitation home. Though some of the children have been reunited with their families, the two pastors in charge of the church are still in detention. Ayodeji Muradio, TVC News, Akure.